This is the Chinese cooking channel called Chinese Cooking Channel. Today we're doing my recipe for Chinese barbecue pork. The first method is using an air fryer versus using a regular oven. Which method do you think produces the most tasty Chinese barbecue pork? I'll give you my results. Here we have two and a half pounds of pork shoulder bite. Cut the pork into four or five pieces lengthwise. To make the marinade, you need a soybean based sauce. The first is char siu sauce or spare ribs. The second one is a sweet sauce. And then the third one is a black bean sauce with garlic. All three are soybean based, so you can use a combination of any of the three. To make the marinade, my rule of thumb is to use three or four tablespoons of any soybean sauce per pound of pork. So here it's about seven to 10 tablespoons of soybean sauce. So next, add three to four tablespoons of light soy sauce. This is also known as regular soy sauce. I add two or three tablespoons of my favorite sauce, which is the Chinese oyster sauce. Then I add three or four tablespoons of tomato sauce. So if you don't have tomato sauce, just use ketchup. You can add one or two tablespoons of pure sesame oil. Make sure it's a pure sesame oil rather than the blended oils. Here, sesame oil adds a nice nutty flavor. To add a little red color to your marinade, you can use food color, but I'd rather use a natural ingredient. So I'll put a tablespoon of beet powder. I like to sharpen up the flavor of the marinade. So I'll put a few pinches of pink Himalayan salt. Now pour the marinade over the pork, mix it into the pork and let it sit for at least one or two hours to get extra flavor. We're gonna cook the Chinese barbecue pork in the air fryer for 20 minutes at 390 degrees. If you like, you can turn the pork over at the halfway mark, which is roughly 10 minutes. This time you can baste the pork with some extra marinade. You can also add a touch of honey for no sweetness on the surface of the barbecue. Temperature reaches 165 degrees. It's cooked to medium well. The barbecue pork sit for about 10 minutes. Then you're ready to slice it. So you can see the meat is done really well. So it's a slight pink sometimes. So the uh, roast pork, when you use the air fryer, it tends to cook real fast, so you get some burn marks here. So you might want to turn it down lower if you have any sugar in your marinade. So that one uh, char siu sauce has uh, maltose. Maltose burns, it's, it, maltose is a kind of sugar. So if you don't have a sugar, you probably could do it at 390 degrees for 20 minutes. If, it's, uh, if it has uh, maltose or honey or any kind of sugar, then you have to turn it down to maybe, uh, say, 325 and cook it for 25, maybe 30 minutes. So just a little tip. In the regular oven, 
We're also going to cook the Chinese barbecue pork for 20 minutes at 390 degrees. After 20 minutes, the pork has only reached 120 degrees. In the regular oven, I'm not going to turn the pork over, but I'm going to baste the pork with some honey and put it back in the oven for another 20 to 25 minutes. Temperature of the pork has reached 180 degrees, so the meat is well done. So here you get almost no burn marks using the oven. So it takes longer to cook. So I would say uh, using the air fryer takes about 20 to 25 minutes to cook the uh, char siu barbecue pork. So using the regular oven, it's gonna take anywhere from, I'd say 45 to 50 minutes. Char siu cool off for at least 10 to 15 minutes. So as you can see, the, uh, the oven cooked char, char siu is um, more evenly cooked. There's no burn marks, hardly any burn marks. And then uh, it takes maybe almost twice as long to cook sometimes. So you just uh, cook it for about 40, about 40 minutes, 35, 40 minutes, and then you broil it for 10 to 15 minutes. I put some honey at the end just to um, give it a more sweet taste because this has maltose. Uh, it should burn if you heat it too high. So I put it at 390, so it didn't really get any burn marks on a regular oven. So we're just gonna check, see if it's cooked all the way through. So nicely cooked, nicely cooked. So you can see the meat. So it hit 179. So it's nice to cook it all the way through because once you get over 165, when you hit 165, you might get a bit of a pink tinge on your meat. So this hit um, 100, almost 180 degrees. So it looks really nice. It's hot. So the oven cooked char siu, there's hardly any burn marks. It's more evenly cooked. And it takes a little bit longer, almost uh, maybe twice as much time sometimes, but it's well worth it. Mm. There you have it, my version of Chinese barbecue pork. Enjoy. Thanks for checking out my video and be sure to give me a thumbs up and also subscribe so you can get the next new video. And thanks to my viewers for helping me win the top 20 best Chinese food blogs in the world. And also I was awarded the top 40 China YouTube channels in the world. And also uh, please subscribe, just press the button.